Okay, we are back with season one, episode thirteen of Veronica Mars. Episode ended with Logan's mom, I guess, committing suicide over the whole press scandal. So that was pretty intense. Um, I imagine there will be some fallout from that. Otherwise, oh yeah, Veronica was like spying on people's like talk with the guidance counselor about Lily, which was like not really cool. But I I already talked about all my feelings from that in the last episode. So let's just get into this one, yeah. Nice. Who are these people? You know that boy didn't stand to get hit in the head with a dodgeball or two. Stop. Talking as well as slow. I'll do more and talk to her, alright? Mm. It's your line. Something's happened. Uh oh. How's Logan looking at it? He hasn't been at school since. Mm. We're not exactly phone buddies. It's just hair. I'm guessing the urge to touch. You keep what? The That's not cool. Oh. Reported to have held a man out of a window in order to get him to sign a contract. What? Twice jailed. The door's missing. No. God, that's Yolanda Hamilton's dad. That's if he knows her. Well, I guess she was one of the rich crowd. Oh, that's the. Okay, that's. And then going into the title sequence. I see what they did. It's a little much. Maybe your team. Fair enough. No, he made a list. Okay. <laughs> oh, God, bro. Yeah, I want to be sympathetic to Logan, but that's really gross. What does she do? About two months into his sentence, I was leaving work. Whoa, wait. Pulled up, fired ten shots what? I mean, wow. When Jamie and I left, it was probably around midnight. Yonder was still there. Um. But she had her car. She's my friend. Who are you? Okay, that's a little. I don't know what happened at the party. Pop. Wow. Wait, she actually sent a telegram? I mean, he has, you know, every right to be mad at his dad. <laughs> like, he, he, he traded his mom with crap. What's going on there? I'm, do I'm doing a project. Do it somewhere else, right? Okay, so my next follow you are. Oh no. This is the story about them breaking up. Oh, is she the girl Logan was kissing at the party? I bet, yeah, she's probably the girl that broke up Lily and Logan. She is being very dangerous. I mean, what else is new? Enjoy your stay. That was awkward. Um. <laughs> no, you don't. Well, it was your fault. Um, he's not gonna. That's not gonna work. Is it? Oh, come on, cameras. Screw them. Okay, okay. 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 Ooh. Ooh. And in front of the cameras. You were hiding in a bush taking pictures. These people. Paparazzi. Gross. Gross. That whole beha that behavior is disgusting. It's too bad. She really liked you, Doc. No, I liked mm. her. Oh boy, this is... Yeah. Yeah. This is... 
me ask you one other question. I don't know you want to see you. Oh. Oh. So it was Lily's fault they stopped hanging out. That makes sense, I guess. This is like me holding you out of the window. Oof. Mm, fair enough. Ow. Oh, that was gross. Oh, harsh. Kind of fair, but harsh. Sam Bloom Esquire has a son named Benjamin, who was at the club the night she disappeared. Huh. Mm -hmm. So he's got to put on pads. I mean, it is pretty poor taste. Oh, okay. She left it on her dresser the night she disappeared. Oh, he doesn't believe she's dead. And she's not dead. Uh, I can't tell if he's right or losing it. He and some friends are in Mexico hiking. Can't be reached. Convenient. Oh, come on, Veronica. Should have talked to Lily. Give it to them. Um. What else would it be? I have my justice right here. Um. I don't think he's gonna be in there. <gasps> Wait. He did it? She was on the phone talking about meeting someone at the club. Running off forever. I rolled in the Might not room. end well. Oh, uh, was it the it's Benjamin well guy that ran off together? So you can be mad, Dad. But you can't call me so. Huh. <laughs> What? Oh boy. Um. Okay. Oh boy. Um. Well, that's awkward. I don't know what to think about that. Um. So. That was quite an episode. Um, I did not expect the Logan Plotin to go there. I mean, he thinks she ran off, and he wants to find her. I don't know, the way he was talking about her being free doesn't- I mean, I guess he probably doesn't want to drag her back. He just wants to know where she is, but obviously since Veronica's mom ran off, will be like a- I mean, that's like a sort of personal thing for her, but interesting that he would go to Veronica. I guess he still trusts her despite everything, um, because I'm sure he could hire P.I. with- well, I guess it, not without his dad knowing, I don't know. But the way he went to her... It's interesting. I mean, is he right that she ran off and didn't kill herself? I don't know. You know, for a sec, I'd like to believe it's true, but who, who knows? I mean, he might just be, uh, in denial, but it's, it's possible. I mean, they're definitely... The way they showed it, we never- like, we, the audience, never saw her do it, so... I guess that's what the show wants us to think, at least for now, so I'll go with that. Um, but yeah, the five months, that's, that's really interesting, the ending. Um, the plot with Yolanda, and I feel bad for her. I mean, I'm glad she and Veronica sort of made up by the end, but I don't know, especially, like, I understand, like, she chose Lily over her, but after Lily's death, why would she not make any effort to become a friend? I mean, I guess there was a lot going on, I don't know, but, like, there's, it's been, like, more than a year, so like, she could have tried to make amends with Veronica, sorry, with Yolanda, um, at any point after that, but yeah, I don't know, um, I wonder, yeah, I know, so there was a whole thing with her, like, Lo telling Lily about Logan, and he blames her, sort of, for Lily's death, but he also said he blames himself, so, but yeah, I wonder if that, if that'll come up while they're apparently working together, um, yeah, there's a lot of interesting stuff going into the next episode. Um, so yeah, uh, let's not waste any more time. Uh, 
Make sure to like, comment, subscribe uh, for more reactions, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!